a Duncan disappointing result uh, yeah I think so for for the fact that we've probably give three goals away um, we'll never knock the girls work right you know that's pretty much an ethos of the club that we never say die um, but if you give three three goals away you're going to struggle to get results in games um, at 2-1 I think you know most people around the pitch and us included thought that we were going to snatch another 2-2 draw um, at least but probably give a third goal um, and then it, it's going to be an up, up, uphill task from there so disappointed and Jess a disappointing result but obviously you've uh, done that fantastic run down the wing which has led to Millie pulling a goal back that must be pleasing yeah it was very pleasing and at 2-1 I thought after that we could get it back but then conceding straight after is a bit deflating. But we always believed that we could go on and get something, but it just didn't happen today. Obviously, last week you were watching on from the sidelines as the girls did come from two goals back. When that went in, did you think, yeah, there was a chance of doing it? Yeah, definitely. Like, always believed that we can win. Even at 3-1, I believed that we could still go on. But it just didn't happen today. So where do the side go from here, Duncan? How are they going to pick themselves up? There's lots of positives. You know, we can't... Again, this is a development league. We want results. We always want results. That's why the girls are where they are and, you know, we are where we are because you've got that competitive spirit. So, of course, you want results. But the second half, Man City haven't been in the game. Um, we've just got to learn. Um, obviously, our decision-making's got to be better. Uh, to concede them three goals, as I've said, um, you can't give away three goals and expect to get a result. The girls will always give a, you know, a hundred percent and keep going and keep going, and you always believe that they're capable of getting back into games. You know, the standout performances. So there's a lot of positives to take um, from the game, and we uh, go to, I believe, Villa at home next week. So we go again. Yeah, and looking ahead to that Villa game, the hopes have got to be three points, haven't they? Yeah, <laughs> we'd love three points. Um, but again, if we get the performances, it, it'll come, you know. And, and again, Jess is with me today. Fantastic, you know. And, and some of the younger girls have got to look up to the likes of Jess and Millie Bright um, and Lauren Cresswell, who were here to help them. Um, it might not be them three next week, but... Uh, the first team girls will come in and, and bring them on and, and again we'll, we'll hope for three points but as long as we get performances that's that's the main thing And Jess from a player's perspective what are your hopes for next week? Uh, well always hope to be in the squad really but obviously if all the girls are coming in I'll support them just hope we get the three points